My Tom Story Library, Freddy. This is a story about Fearless Freddy. Everyone had heard tales of Fearless Freddy. He thought he was the fastest engine in all of Sodor. But then Renez and Scarlowy challenged Freddy to a race. One day, an old friend was returning to the narrow gauge railway. His name was Fearless Freddy. He was fast, fun, and fearless. Thomas brought Freddy to the transfer yards. Hello, Sir Handel, wished Freddy. Hello, Freddy, whistled Sir Handel. I haven't seen you for years. Fearless Freddy is back, puffed Freddy. I didn't know you two were friends, peeped Thomas. Oh, yes, puffed Sir Handel. Freddy was the fastest engine in the hills. Suddenly, Renez and Scarlowy raced into the yards. I'm the winner, peeped Scarlowy. No, I am, wished Renez. Who are you, pouted Freddy. We're the fastest engines in the hills, chimed Scarlowy. I'll show you who's fastest, boasted Freddy. I'll race you to the mountain. Freddy was sure he was going to win. Freddy huffed and puffed up the mountain. It was harder than he remembered. Flatten my fennel, he wished. I used to be able to chop up here in no time. Renez and Scarlowy were waiting to start the race. Freddy puffed in slowly. All right, fearless Freddy, tooted Renez. Ready, steady, go! whistled Scarlowy, and they were off. Freddy was racing very fast, but soon he began to run out of puff. Oh no! Those young engines will bump my buffers! He chuffed as he slowed down. Suddenly, Freddy had an idea. He remembered an old track. The old rocky way! He thought excitedly. No one will remember that now! Freddy steamed down the track. Renez and Scarlowy did not see that he had taken a shortcut. The tracks on the old rocky way were old and wobbly, but this way was much quicker. Freddy got to the bottom of the mountain in no time. Renez and Scarlowy chuffed in. You're so fast, wished Renez. Race you again, huffed Scarlowy. Please, fearless Freddy. Of course, Fearless Freddy never says no to a race, boasted Freddy. Renez and Scarlowy were soon ready to stop. Renez and Scarlowy were soon ready to race again. We'll race you down the other side this time, said Renez. The other side of the mountain is very steep, peeped Freddy. You're not scared, are you? teased Scarlowy. Of course not. I'm fearless Freddy, chuffed Freddy. Off we go! Freddy raced ahead of the other engines, but he began to run out of puff again. Fearless Freddy didn't want to lose. I can take the craggy track and then I will win. So Freddy took another shortcut. The track was old and wobbly, just like the last one. Freddy was us Freddy was usually fearless, but this time even he was a little but this time even he was a little frightened. Freddy soon arrived at the bottom of the mountain, safe and sound. But Renez and Scarlowy were not safe and sound. The track was very steep, and Renez had raced right off the rails. Scarlowy raced up to Freddy. Renez has come off the track, cried Scarlowy. I don't know where he is. We were trying to catch you, Fearless Freddy, but you were too fast. Freddy knew he hadn't been fast at all. He had tricked the little engines, and now Renez was in trouble. Sir Handel puffed in with the thin controller. He had heard what had happened to Renez. It's all my fault, sniffed Freddy. Freddy told everyone how he had won the races. You tricked us! tooted Scarlowy. And now Renez is lost and in trouble! No, he isn't! 
whistled Freddy loudly. I can find him. I know all the tracks. Please, sir, follow me. And so Freddy steamed away to rescue Reneus. Freddy knew another forgotten track, the old mountainside run. He led the rescue party down the he led the rescue party down to the valley, and there was Reneus. I'm so happy you found me, peeped Reneus. So am I, puffed Freddy. The Thing Controller, the Fireman, Freddy, Sir Handel, and Scarlowey pulled Reneus back onto the track. All the engines clapped carefully back to the transfer yards. I'm sorry I tricked you, puffed Freddy. You're much faster engines than me. But you know all the old tracks, peeped Reneus. Please tell us about them. So Freddy began to tell the young engines... So Freddy began to tell the young engines tales about the old tracks. Everyone was happy that fearless Freddy was back.